Hi everyone, uh, Jeff again. Um, I've had uh, someone ask me the other day about, you know, the deep hook. They're wondering how deep they have to hook the string. What do I actually mean by that? Well, I did another video and I'm going to put a link to it on the deep hook and why I think a deep hook is necessary. Um, but to me, a deep hook means just putting that string in those three digits right here in my fingers. It's not wrapping my fingers around the string like this. The fingers don't have to go back to me. It's just they're, they're resting in the digits. The string is resting in the digits, okay? So when I draw, okay, the string is in the digits. And that's what to me a deep hook means. It doesn't mean actually wrapping those fingers around the string. It just means I'm not shooting off the pads of my fingers. I'm shooting off the digit of my fingers. So that what happens is that those digits can then support the weight. Okay? So if I do a close-up, that's how I'm grabbing right there. Okay. Now, uh, another question I get people asking me is, well, should I shoot three under or should I shoot split finger? Doesn't matter. It's all personal preference. It's what you like. Myself, because I, again, I do a lot of wing shooting and I shoot fast, I like split finger with a glove. I can find the string without even looking. Go up. Okay? I don't need to position a tab and figure where things are. I like to be able to feel the string. You see my glove, how lovely my glove is. It's just broken in. <laughs> okay? I like to be able to feel things on the string. I like to feel that knock of the arrow. And that's my personal preference. I shoot split finger because I like to be able to get on target quickly and I like to be able to feel the knock on the string. Um, many people, especially target archers that, that uh, shoot three under, they'll want to use a big, thick, heavy tab. And they don't want the feel of the string. They want me to be more mechanical, like a mechanical device where they take human error out of it. And I understand that fully. And again, that's just personal preference whether you want a really thick tab or a light tab or a shooting glove or a tight shooting glove. Um, it's all personal preference, what you like. There's no right or wrong way to do it. Um, it's just a way that's right or wrong for you. And, uh, you know, I don't recommend either way to anyone. They kind of have to find their own path and think of how they want to shoot and what type of shooting they want to do. Target archers tend to shoot three under because it tends to put the arrow closer to their eye. Okay? Um, I, don't, I don't even reference the arrow, so it doesn't matter to me. Um, if you want to look at, you know, uh, again, I, I mentioned this before, I'm an instinctive shooter, and that's a, a dirty word. But again, I'm going to do a video about that another time. Um, but, uh, you know, there are so many different ways to shoot and grip thumb releases, everything. It's just personal preference. So if someone asks me, tab, glove, three under, split finger, it's up to you. There's no right or wrong way. Okay. I just wanted to kind of clear up those two uh, points. Uh, and I hope everybody has fun. Bye-bye.